Hi Eagles, welcome back to another Updates with Sports and I'll be announcing this week's games. Starting off our week on Monday, April, May 3rd, there will be a girls volleyball game versus Southgate High School at Bell and a boys volleyball game versus Southgate at Southgate. On Tuesday, April, May 4th, there will be a girls softball and boys baseball game versus Legacy High School at Legacy and there will also be a girls volleyball game versus Roosevelt at Roosevelt High School. Ending our week on May 6th, there will be a girls softball and boys baseball game versus Legacy at Bell and a girls volleyball game versus Garfield at Garfield High School. Um, I hope everyone has a great week and good luck to everyone that's playing. Hey Eagles, so um, just a quick announcement before I do the Q&A questions for the freshmen and the sophomores. The junior shirt has extended until May 14. You guys can still purchase it. The link can be found on the Instagram or in, on Schoology. And yeah, that's it. So um, starting off with the freshman Q&A, um, somebody asked how many weeks are left of school. Um, there's about five weeks left of school. And is there going to be more students going back to school in person next year? That all depends on the district, um, when they're gonna announce how we're gonna go back, when, I'm not sure, but that's all I have right now. And that's all the freshman questions. And now for the sophomore Q&A. Um, somebody asked, is there going to be any activities before the school year ends? If you mean like in-person activities, um, I think that's a no because we still have to follow um, COVID guidelines. Is there going to be any more clubs? Um, if you mean like new clubs, uh, I don't think so because it's the end of the year and most clubs are introduced in the beginning. Is it mandatory to go back to school next school year? Um, if LAUSD makes it mandatory, then yes. Uh, when's the last day of school? The last day of school is June 11th. Any ideas for what to do over the summer, like summer programs for high school students? Um, for sophomores, I think you guys should uh, volunteer as much as you can, like in nursing homes or churches, or like doing extracurriculars. Focus on what you like, find what you like to do, and make sure you get hours done for your um, college application and stuff like that. But make sure you like what you're doing too. Um, that's all I have for you guys. Thank you. Have a great week. Hey seniors, here's a senior update on graduation. Starting off, graduation will be split. It will be on June 10th and June 11th at Bow High School starting at 6 p.m. Each student will be able to bring two guests. And for cap and gowns, they will be ready to be picked up on the same week as graduation. FYI, there will be a more in-depth graduation meeting on Zoom, so keep on the lookout for any more information on that. One more announcement, so the service learning committee and leadership has taken upon themselves to host a service learning spirit, spirit week. Um, so basically the Spirit Week is just giving out any type of ideas for those students who haven't completed their service learning. Um, as many of you guys know, service learning is needed to graduate. So you guys should take advantage of the Spirit Week. It will be hosted on from May 3rd to May 7th. They will be giving you guys a lot of options so you guys can complete your service learning. Some of the options that they are giving you is donate to a food bank, to a thrift store, you can tutor an underclassmen, you can volunteer online with Red Cross, or you can do it in person. Or you can also volunteer at a local pet rescue. Um, so keep a lookout on all of the Instagrams so that you guys can check out these opportunities and take advantage of them. In order to fulfill the requirement, there will be a panel that you guys have to post on, and there will be a Google form that you guys have to fill out, and then you are done.